Hallelujah, glory be to God. So, wisdom creates more wealth. Foolishness depreciates it. Taking counsel from the ungodly makes you lose your wealth. Also, your access to revelation, information, knowledge. In First Chronicles chapter 12, verse 32, the Bible says that the children of Issachar, I think I read it to you. He said, from Issachar, descendants were 200 leaders who understood the times and knew what Israel should do. Their relatives were under their command. Sir, the knowledge you have, the revelation you have, the access you have to relevant information in your field, in your location, determine who is in charge. The more information you have, put you in charge. The more revelation you have, put you in charge. The more access you have to God, God, put you in charge. That's what the Bible says in Deuteronomy 29, 29. And I'd like to also read that as I conclude. It says, some things are hidden. They belong to the Lord our God. But things that are being revealed in these teachings belong to us and to our children forever. We must obey every word of this teaching. As I'm telling you, you must hear me and do what I'm asking you. You must apply yourself to God. You must get information from God. God knows the end of a thing from the beginning. So if he gives you information, you know, it's just like going for an exam and you have seen the question, you have practiced the question, you enter the exam or this question you have practiced what you saw in the exam or of course, except there's something that's not wrong. So if your relationship with God is in good state, you are like that. You have good information about what is about to happen before it will happen. Remember the story in, in Second uh, King chapter 6? The Bible says that the king said everything he ha- is said in his secret is known to the king of, of Samaria because of the man of God that have access to information from God. Sir, seek out God. Let God lead you this year. Let him give you the blueprint and your word creation will only increase and never decrease. The Lord bless you.